Oh, might as well make it better. Yep, not even Kazuna can stand against this. Thanks for messing around with some more Vampire Survivors Beswick. We will be showing off with Eleanor in a stage I really should have checked before I did anything with. Wow, she's going home. I thought she would be doing that, but I didn't check ahead of time. I am a professional. Da, 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 da. All right, so due to the way Eleanor works, she's going to have a bit of a funky setup here. Because I'm not evolving that. That would be dumb. Let's show off what all three of them at the base can do. So that would mean that I actually have to do something strange. Very strange. And then I'm going to have to banish one of these at max level. I, mean, I could have just, you know, sealed it off correctly, but then I would miss out on at least four levels of power. And hey, it's not, Spell String isn't so bad at base level if you assign old Sanctuary to power it up. Actually pretty decent. Ah, looks kind of funny, doesn't it? Da da da. Hmm. Actually, let's see what they all look like for their final one. Because, you know, one more projectile is pretty nice on a weapon like that. And the reason I have Tronus Box instead of, you know, each of them actually gets bonuses, increased bonuses off of stat boosts. It's speed, area, and might. The Tronus Box hits all of those, which is nice. Well, you want Empty Tome, because Empty Tome, and well, I'm going to need as much damage as possible. Without, because I can't evolve. Hmm. Well, let's see what my choice is going to be. Their spell, strike, damage further multiplied by amount. Or a might. Why did I say amount? Everything gets bonus to buy amount. Might. Oh, right, I have a Kami badge, too. Well done, reduced. Da, da, da. Damage up by 40. In fact, I should just banish, show it all off. Banish one on the first, banish the second on the other, and then the third on the final. They don't want you. Alright, cooldown reduced by 0.3 seconds. Boy, I want all three of them up. Okay, I have one projectile on the weakest one. Cooldown reduced by 0.3 seconds on the most damaging one. And base area up. I do think spell strings probably the worst of these, but for the next one, I'll ban spell stream and then spell strike from the final. Well, it'll be at the easiest. Bye bye, Academy badge. Bye bye. Okay, gotta get Toronas up first. I mean, I guess I could just avoid. No wait. It... Is it f no, it doesn't fuse automatically. Sometimes things are weird. Geez, 700 damage per hit. He's not going to have trouble. <laughs> I need to use that on the ones that scale off might. I mean, if it's doing that much with just 173, it'll be crazy good later. This doesn't really matter. I 
Let me throw that on. Let's see. Suto, Megalo Suto, Pagnala, Senta. Heck, all three of them are base. Heck plus Spell Storm itself. You just compensate with good old, whatchamacallit, Blue of Illusions and Chaos in the Dark Knight. Okay. Newt. Newt with that. Newt with these three. Very good. He gets might off of speed. Scale up off that crazy strong. And yeah, when I get back to Newt or well, no. Fourth wave is not gonna be conductive to that. Fifth wave doesn't exist yet. It's only theory and politicking. Alright, there's an Arcana chest on the map. Perhaps I should go grab that. And there's some clovers too. Small clovers. You're gonna need to get awake. Despite everything, this is still gonna be a HP times level final wave. We need to be nice and safe for that. Safety comes from being awake. Other option, they're somewhat more limited. At the very least, I can take it on the Atlantean. No trouble between these. Gotta make sure I don't run face first into it. Sparkly. Keeping the Academy Badge is still an option. Hmm, put it over. Spinage, get more revives. Actually, probably would have been a better idea. I just wasn't thinking about Academy Badge. Normally, it's just a nice bonus, not something I plan around. Right, get awake early. I don't expect her to fall to anything but the Green Knights at the end, but still, just in case. And just in case, get some eggs. At least I fail. And I inevitably fail. And HP times level. Oh man. These guys are getting in. Maybe area would have been better. We had a nice bigger blast for both the big hitters. No, I wasn't. Huh. Odd. The damage is good. Damage keeps it up. Dun, 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 dun. Nothing affects this at all. I guess I could go. I should go Boogaloo, shouldn't I? Really helps out the damage on one of them. Oh, dang, pots. Well. Oh, hey, big red gem. Helen Wars going for a swim. Yep. Focus damage is no trouble. Really just going to be when they're all HP times level at the end. Be so bad. But yeah. I think it'd be a really good set of weapons on old Newt. You get might from speed. Speed boosts up spell string. Might boosts up spell strike. And spell stream is boosted up by area, so you can boo blue. Bad. Wait, did I do third? I have to have done third wave of Operation Guns. I was trying to hit that iron while well, it was hot. Ta -da. 
Okay, this place is usually pretty hefty. They're getting taken out pretty good. Yeah, it was a boss that got taken out instantly. Nice. Well, you're lasting a lot longer than your Mooney compatriot. Ouch. Half a second. Oh, boy. At least genre never seems to last that long, and I'm stuck here. It's because it starts earlier, but you don't see it for like the first minute, usually. It's so far down. Don't want to go too up, because you know, then he'll just start, ch he'll just start chasing me. Calls and issues that way. Bye bye. Oh, double drowner, really? Good grief. Last thing I need to do is get stuck in here with some of the most strangely damaging enemies around. Why are you dipping like that? Dotting around. It should come to the end. Bye bye. And no triple drowner, and I went the wrong way. Ain't okay, not going for skull, not going for armor, not going for anything down there. Kill count's not the greatest, but it's consistent. Ooh, I've seen 500. Is that from the spell stream? Hmm. No, I don't think it's... I think it... Oh, right into the boss. Jeez. Looking at something else. Wow, the stream got really big. Yeah, that's the one doing like 500. Off of not even that much area. Jeez. It's really hard to tell the spell strike, but it's that like white flashing starish effect. Hey, chicken. I went FT in. Alright. Gotta look for some power ups to forward up with. Probably gonna be in the Sam area just so. I can get some pies. Eleanor's got quite the sweet tooth, you know. Yeah, I wanna throw these three around without evolutions. Just cause when are you gonna do that? You get one of these, you're gonna want all of them. Ends up being just one weapon. Oh, snaky snakes. That's a good testament to how strong they are at the moment. Besides, you don't come to the Beswick for normal stuff. Clearly, because my voice is very strange. It's only going to get strangers, it gets more and more damaged by other stuff. Hey, you're just a regular chest. You're not an Arcana chest, you lied to me with that coloration. Got to find the Sammy spawn. I always forget where it is. Here. Yeah, they're going to be kept off, but... That should have been way more levels. I know there's a way to just, like, get them really spawning in. Oh, hey, a luck event. Ooh, boss. Somewhere around there. The Sammies are unthreatening. That means the harder waves don't spawn in, plus it heals me. Huh, didn't drop a pie that time. 
Ooh, Oral again. That'd be a good thing to wrap. Ah, here we go. Right? This tree? Yeah, here we go. This would be a nice place to hold up. And I can grab the Orologian if things get dicey. Well, I guess if things get axy is the real thing here. Oh well, yeah, I also messed with my mic settings a bit more. So give me a shout out about how it sounds now. Hopefully it's not catching the controller clicks and clacks anymore, but... Oh, right, Avatar of Gaia. What? Oh, there was another one that got docked up. Oh, wow, there's two of them. That's good. Two Orologians plus the Sammy cake should be enough to get through this. I got some chickens on the back end, too. Okay, big green knight went down with no trouble. Alrighty. And just stick next to this Orologian down here. But not too close that I grab it. Hmm, maybe getting Boogaloo from the start would be a good idea. Get the scaling going quicker. I don't know, might really need some old sanctuary just to not die horribly. I mean, this would have been a good map to test it out on, because I could have ran straight for the Arcana chest. Oh well. Right, 28's the Green Knights, 29 is the Abyss Foscari thingies. Oh, that's a bit dicier than I was hoping for. You always forget to tell the worst possible moment. Alright, here comes the pain. Good grief. Not even 10 seconds. Another oral again right above me. And I know there's one more down here somewhere. Uh, blind search, not good. There we go. Well, line on pickups to survive, but hey, it is there. And now we have a much weaker wave to deal with. And Sammy's are showing up in abundance. Eleanor is saved. Due to oral game power and really nothing else. Definitely not a good build. Oh, hey, another Aurel again. Nice. Alright, well, that's the first victory on Eleanor's streak. That's nice to have. And if she can embrace death like she's always wanted. Hmm. 31.4 million on the spell stream. Pretty dang good. And, sp er, spell stream, not spell string. All right, time for Eleanor to head over to Bat Country, and oh boy, you know it's not good. He starts on it. Yep, gotta get some old sanctuary. I just need the XP too quickly. And Google Illusions does not do that. One more. Da -da -da. More projectile. Them waves cleared as soon as possible. One more. One more projectile. Oh, this is so much faster. One more projectile. Blast them all, keep them nice and contained, and then run through them when they spawn in outside. Already maxed out spell string. And it's spell stream that's gonna be getting slower here. Get that empty tomb going.
Ooh, empty tome, empty tome. Save the world, empty tome. Go around. Oh man, I need to lure them out so I can get all these gems. Nice and far in. Of course that spawns in. In already. A higher level than the failed run. Which was at seven minutes. At least. Yeah, it was not great. Get you now. And then I can banish immediately. Of course, empty tomb. Yep, they're not standing a chance now. That's nice. Nice change of pace, then struggling on for forever. Yeah, since Boo Boo doesn't even affect spell string, don't get much use out of it, huh? Hey, hey. I'm Fonzie up in here. Spinage. I think Henry Winkler's still alive, right? I mean, I don't remember reading any news that he's dead. Yeah, the rest of the cast. God. In pop culture, he just dominated the whole thing. Well, besides Jump the Shark, but hey, we're not going to hold that against him. Yep, and spell strike. Time to level up with a vacuum. Ooh. Okay, yeah, I can get a even if it's a fiver with Toronas box. Wow, what is that? Like just the Toronas box beefs it up to seven hundred? That's crazy. Da, da, da. Oh no, it's that. Oh boy, is it that. Jumps it up by like 300 because of the multiplier. Cooldown reduction is nice, but not the real killer. It's that base damage going up. Not actually very good at taking care of the bonus stuff. Which is a shame since that's where a lot of the safety of this map comes from. Oh, multiple levels up in a row. Nice. Recording? Also nice. Candy badge exists. Banish that high level Toronas box. I don't want that at all. Well, might as well get him out if I'm here. Random always. Yep, nothing there. I wish there was a way like, to like specify the order for random always. Like, oh, I want Flash here to get him out. Incorrect chance, then might, then area, then speed, something like that. It's probably way too much to program in. Sure do hope the ability to limit passives comes through, though. It's like the one thing in the Discord I actually bother to suggest. Hey, it's time to be awake.
Level up, level up, get that area up. Orange with banana. I mean, I'm sure there is some non-English word you could rhyme orange with, right? Like orange. Ha 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 ha. Uh, oh, 50 soon. Oh, that's a lot of mineral rush. Well, not one of the fastest clears of the sides I've gone to, but hey, I've had worse as well. At least it's consistent. Consistently slow. Hmm. I guess there's a hit delay preventing them from being wiped out immediately by these. Because the spell string should be popping one at a time if it's concentrating like that. Oh, rosary. What? Why is... What? What's with the purple? What's going on with the purple? That's odd. Very odd. Because the bats are, some of the bats are purple. Do this always do purple stuff. I didn't notice. Oh, hey, the Death Square. Strangely enough, I didn't get the Death Square. I mean, I got to the Death Square on the fail run, but it was way earlier than this. Weird. Well, I guess Death Box would be better. It's clearly trying to box you in. Unfortunately, they got trapped in here with Eleanor, and that didn't work out well for them. What is that rosary effect? Was that a random event? I don't remember seeing a rosary. And there's one around here still, and I don't think I grabbed it. Yeah, it's over there. Yeah. Decently long enough gold fever. Is that out of sync with... Okay, so the gold fever timer and the actual timer at the top of the sage are out of sync when you're in a hurry. I suppose it shouldn't come as a surprise, but... Well... Is it really something you think about? Is it really something you notice? Oh. Give me a comment if it has. Kinda curious about that. But only kind of. And they're coming in hard. Fast. Vacuum time. Whoa. Oh, gosh. There's so many. I actually thought they were background for a minute. Boy, that would have been embarrassing to run off towards. Grab the wake, right? Not the best option, but hey. Er, of course it's the best option. It means I don't die. Now, normal play, it's clearly at the bottom, but incredibly dopey challenges like I'm doing, it's probably one of the best. Sometimes you just need to revive over and over and over and over again in order to survive. But not this time. Not this time. You'll have just barely enough damage to get through this. That's nice. No evolutions, Eleanor coming in on the Beswick. Wait now. Wow, spell strike. Wow. 
Man, so Spell Scream's final accumulates a lot of its effect, huh? Alrighty, time for Eleanor to head over to a bonus stage, and it's gonna be a good old whiteout here. Where a spell strike once ruled the day. With random. Yeah, you really need silent old sanctuary. Just to get going correctly. I mean, speed is speed. Speed is speed. And projectile amount is projectile amount. Not even getting close, Skullos. Base damage up by one. The most damage there could ever be. It's actually kind of impressive how they can't get anything done. Even against a presence as light as this. 89. Wow, did I get really enough eggs to boost her up to 89? Jeez. And you spell stream get to max out. Warp spell strike doesn't get its cooldown reduction. So I can already say clearly, if you want to sacrifice one of them to keep all three around, then it's going to be Spell String. There's really no point unless you're doing a challenge, because obviously the evolution is just going to be all three in one, and better. But hey, that's your option if you don't want to evolve things. Can you banish the evolution? Or seal the evolution? Actually, considering it's this map, I probably didn't need to do that. It's gonna be like one chest anyway. Yeah, I, mean, I should have decent clearance on the snowmen. Show that Jack Frost, Eleanor, or is in. Shouldn't have done that. Well, there's only going to be one level anyway. They were not this slow before. 30 damage with spell string. Oh boy. I'm going to go higher. Thank you, Tarona's Box, for maxing out the damage. Because you're maxing out the might. Effectively. Oh. Well, I mean, I guess a weight could go farther. I don't guess a weight could go further. I know a weight could make it go further. Hopefully I don't have to use it to go further. Wow, oh, already. Or I even get Tarona's er, spell strike itself. Wait. Oh, it already spawned in. I just forgot to grab it. Spell strike. Spell strike. Right into the dang snowmans. You could probably get it in no trouble. They really don't want to deal with banish and skip and other stuff. Well, not that I'm going to get three arcana on this level anyway. Yay, wait out for weird stuff going on. I know what the dumb title would be. Eleanor, with no evolution. Better or worse? Obviously worse. Like, it's not even a comparison. Oh, whoops, I got it maxed by accident. Well, void the chests. Shouldn't be too hard. I'm just in the zone. I just spell strike have duration. Why does it have duration? No part of that is duration-y. It just blasts once then and goes off. I mean, I'm not going to be... 
I mean, heck, basically the only evolution chests come from Kitson. Oh, don't fall. Not even at 10 minutes yet. First one's not till like 12 anyway. And that's only Kitson. No, Kitson is pal. It's Kizun. It's Kizun. Right, yeah, I just wrote that down for the last video. I was head on white out. Kizun. Huh. Play this like a dozen dozens of times beforehand. Kept forgetting the name, but as soon as I write it down, I remember it. Weird. Cracked that orb. Avoid that chest. Actually, it's vacuum. So vacuum those gems. Even the robots aren't getting much done. Okay, I just I just don't want to call them golems. They look so much like robots, and it's not like it's that out of bound. What with the whole predator thing running around in laboratory. Besides, this is not the most serious game. What with the still no vampires years after first release. Blast through them, Eleanor. Blast through them all. Silence is golden, and Eleanor is blue. Blast them all with your Logan power. Crap. Ugh. Well, I didn't want to do that, but it's... Oh, wait. I set it to one weapon slot, so I can't get another. I mean, it ruined the 333, but, well, it's white out. That was ruined anyway, because the other Arcana just doesn't spawn in. Oh, well. Everything dies horribly now. And it makes Sign Old Sanctuary even better. Really wanted to not evolve it. Really wanted to not evolve it. But oh well. Roll the dice. Lean with punches. And get smashed. Huh. Yeah, there are kind of chests that exist. That's odd. Oh, might as well make it better. Yep, not even Kazuna can stand against this ultimate power. Let's see, how did I keep bloody losing with her? With this on the table? Like, yeah, it wasn't Silent Old Sanctuary, but that doesn't really matter. I think she should have been more powerful with more weapons. Yes, yes, Kazune, you're very boxy. 
and put out that fire before something gets burned. There we go. Enemies? What enemies? There are no enemies before Eleanor's spell storm and might. Oh. Right. Don't run into snowmen. They're still dangerous. Sometimes. But only sometimes, and especially not when they're constantly being frozen by chain or Logians. As well, what is? Well, I guess if you have a freezing weapon, and something can be, because then they just be unfrozen. Because it would break the freeze for some reason. Triple or Logian power. Oh no, all the snowmen are gone. Who knows what's even spying anymore? It's been frozen for so long. I mean, if I hadn't gone just so far south, I probably could have kept in the zone with all of them. Oh, so it's just some more snowmen's. Trying to get revenge for all your compatriots, I've Bell storm day. Well, unfortunately, you're going to be even colder than you already are. Or a Logan time. But death, death will always get its due. And in no time whatsoever, spell storm has completely crushed everything else to an absurd degree. All right. Not much trouble, but Eleanor has taken us up to 419, 420, good old 420, and 421 on the Beswick. That's nice having three videos, or three stages done in a single video. Really makes the number go down quickly. Hey, that's 1,511 more to go. New idea for a thumbnail, just as I'm looking at this. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Thank you anyone who has supported the channel with a like, dislike, comment, or subscribe. And if you haven't, please do so. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.